gave you for you just had to win. And the game is all tied up. It's 50 50. Let's have time. Oh boy. I wonder who's going to win. Well, let's analyze the first quarter, shall we? Let's see how the game has been played, so to speak. In the fourth quarter, well, well, in the first quarter, we saw, we saw a lot of kind of weird, strange things. So we don't know how, how the second quarter is going to be. Because the first quarter, well, it was odd. Here's saying a couple people's out. Please explain to me what the first quarter looked like. So I can have some glimpse as to what the second quarter might be. Now, I'm not going to play Nostradamus for you. I'm not stupid. Don't ask me. Because I never will tell. But here's how the first quarter went. I can't tell you what's happening. Because, well, they say that history doesn't always repeat itself, but it does rhyme. And, you know, 2020 was, well, they said 2020 and um, something about that being perfect vision and hindsight being 2020. Well, if hindsight was 2020, we definitely saw a lot. And that was the first quarter. You see? That was year zero. Now we end it the second quarter, year one. And year one, well, if you learn anything from year zero, well, a lot of people say we didn't learn anything from year zero. We wasted a lot of time arguing. And we could have done more in year zero to prepare us for year one. And then other people argue that we learned a lot in year zero. And we're more prepared. Now that we're in year one. Now, 2020, year zero. 2021, year one. Just in case there was any confusion, mix up, or like I wasn't explaining it correctly. But I just wanted to give you like the Venn diagram portion of it in your brain. You know, you can thank me later. Anyway, year one. We're in February. In the February. Now, let me give you a case and study and a point to all of this to kind of wrap it up. We've had January so far where we had a bunch of, well, I'm just going to say it, white um, nationalists, racists, xenophobes, bigots, um, Nazis, and anything else that you can put on top of that that's um, kind of white. And there was a few raisins in there. Um, sprinkled in the oatmeal. But we saw them like storm and breach the capital in January. You know, the very beginning of the year, the sixth day of the year, January 6th, another day that will live in infamy in America, you know. And then, well, we had some like rookie kids get together. Well, they're not really kids, but they're rookie traders, you know, the board day traders that give all that advice on YouTube. Well, they decided to start a, a Reddit trend and um, bet against some of the hedge funds who had shorted something that they thought they were over leveraged on. Turns out it was a big deal because it shut down the markets. Um, and it did some damage to like all the systems that they don't really want to tell you just just yet. And it might have started a currency war. But uh, I'll get to that in a little bit. Anyway, when you had that happen in... Um, Late January, early February. And now you're in your February. Uh, you're in your February with the expectation in March we're all going to get some more money. And things are going to get better. And the trend run for COVID is going down. And, and things are starting to open back up. And, and, and that, that's, that's where we are. That's what they're telling you. Um, but you got to think. Is all of that true? You gotta think. Does it make any sense to you? Okay. All right. Now, so that's the point of this. 